Assalamu alaikum. This video will explain how to set up the Al Ghadir Shia Azan clock in a step by step process. Please watch other videos on this channel describing the function and button layout of the clock to familiarize yourself before watching the video. Install the batteries or power the clock through the adapter. You can press the talking button to listen to the azan and set up the volume to your choice. Press the stop button to stop the azan. First you would set up the country of your residence. To do that you press the country button and then the set button. Use the up and down buttons to navigate to the country of your choice. Press the exit button when done. Next you would choose is the city of your residence. If your city is not listed, please choose the nearest city or metropolis. Press the city button then the set button. Then use up and down arrow keys to navigate to the city of your residence. Press the exit button when done. Next you would set up the time of day. Press the set button and use the up and down arrow keys to set the hour of day. Press the set button again to move to the minutes and then to the year followed by the month and the day. Press the exit when your time of day is set. The clock will automatically display the Azan timings on the on the right of the display. Compare these timings with the timings of your local masjid or Imam Barga. If you see a difference of about an hour, then press the DST button here once and this will adjust the timing to be closer. And when comparing to my local masjid here, for example, the Fajr Azan here says at 5.48 a.m. My local masjid says the time is 5.49 a.m. So there's a difference of plus one minute. Same as Shuruq says 7.15. My local masjid says 7.17. And Zohar says 12.01 p.m. and my local masjid says it's 12.04 p.m. So what I would do now is set up the delta function of the clock to accurately set up the Azan clock. I would press the set button and go past the set of the day and here it will start blinking zero for Fajr. So since my Fajr was off by plus one minute I would use up arrow once to have a one minute difference. If it was off by one minute less I would have used the down arrow. And this I press the set button again to move to to the shrug, which is off by two minutes, and Zohar and Maghrib was off by three minutes. I would press exit when that is done. The clock is now set up to use matching the timings of your local masjid.
please feel free to email us at contact at shiaproducts.com if you have questions or comments. Thank you for watching.